guys uh, waiting for your grandma? Great grandma. Nana! I knew you'd make it! What are you even doing here? You shouldn't be here. We would have come to pick you up for lunch. I brought pictures, vintage photographs. Who are these people wearing swastikas on their sleeves? The man on the left is Dr. Karl Klauberg. Who is the other man? Dr. Horst Schumann. I, I prefer not to discuss him. I, I never understood him. He was evil. And the woman? That's me, later. No, not later. Nana, you're wearing a... A nurse's uniform. Where was this taken? Auschwitz. Who should I tell? What should I say? She doesn't even want to be forgiven. We can't even bury her here. Did you know him? Did you meet him? No, but I was in Nuremberg in 1934, and I was at the, the nighttime torch rally outside his hotel. I saw him standing on the hotel balcony, and those were the first words I heard. You must be both peace-loving and strong. You haven't lost a single ray of your genius. But if you move forward with it, we'll have problems. Are you completely unrepentant? Seriously, are you completely unrepentant? She worked at Auschwitz. She's a mass murderer. How privileged are we? We will never again know an actual mass murderer so intimately. What about when the war ended and, and the 50s came and films from the liberation of the camps began to surface? How did that make you feel? That I wished we'd won the war so that Carl could have delivered his own daughter, so that I could have placed flowers on my mother's grave.